The fourth lock, Sky, guards the short-term memory, keeping any knowledge of how one got into the prison or any specific escape plans out of the victim's heads. To unlock it, it requires reversing a long-term memory, reversing a conviction or a decision from negative to positive. In my case, I apologized. This triggered the final lock, Jungle, which acts as a sort of failsafe. The fifth lock is everything that came before it, including another jungle lock. Ideally, this causes an infinite loop. You can never actually beat the jungle lock, as it just has more jungle locks inside it. It just keeps your mind busy and separate from other victims forever. So let's see if Eric can escape from it. Mr. Nerd! Where is he? Probably escape without me. Soulless jerk. No, he wouldn't do that. It's his place, so he's probably watching for some hidden camera somewhere. That's right, laugh it up. Laugh it up as I, Eric, strive to struggle with your madness that you've created. Wait a minute, he did make this place. I just gotta think like the hipster nerd. WWHND. What would the hipster nerd do? I got it. Trusty reading glasses. <laughs> I'm the hipster nerd. I'm so much better than everybody else. I hate Minecraft and don't like fun. <sighs> I hate the world. I hate the world. I hate the. Oh, there's a door there! <laughs> Please note that this is a bug. The first lock apparently unlocks for no reason. So that's cool. It's a long hallway. All right, Here we go, final door. Here's the key. All right, let's get this done. Let's go home. Oh, come on! You mean to tell me I have the key and everything and the door still won't open? Hey, Chen, this is all your fault. This stupid place, the, our friendship, all this is your fault. Ah, who am I kidding? It's just as much my fault as is yours. You know what, Commissioner? I'm sorry, man. I don't know where you are, but I'm sorry. I'm sorry for today, and I'm sorry for ruining our friendship. Look, man, if anything, all I want is for us to just walk out of here as friends. I'm sorry, buddy. Okay. Uh. I guess you forget me, or...? <sighs> really, that's a bug too. The final door should just lead back to the first room. There is no way to unlock the final lock. It's an infinite loop, which means someone tampered with my system. Yeah, because nothing you make could ever have flaws. Precisely. Whoever triggered the system to lock us inside hmm, tampered with it to make sure we came out as friends. But who would do that? Who do you think? It was the first question I asked you when you woke up. Who sent you here? Wait, my aunt? Wait, my aunt? No, 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 she's harmless. She runs a secret government facility where the government is trying to engineer a super weapon of some kind that I shouldn't technically know about. Okay, fair point. So is her. But why? Why would she do that? Simple. She wanted us to be friends again. Okay, but why? She trusts us. And she may one day need us to work on something she doesn't trust anyone else with. Something like what? I don't know. But if an unbreakable prison is practiced, then I would certainly like to find out. I think that sounded cooler in your head. Anyway, you know what? I don't really want to find out what that thing is, so I think I'm going to go. 
Okay, bye. I'll see you at chess club. No, no. Just because we're friends again doesn't mean I'm unbanning you from chess club. You're a terrible friend. You too, man. You too. I'm gonna take this. Okay. Interior crocodile alligator. I drive a Chevrolet movie theater.